One of the most common questions we get from customers, either at a trade show or on a sales call, is if, what do I do if I break a cutting tool in a shrink fit holder? How do you get a broken tool out? Well, in a lot of cases, customers will actually bring down the coil and they'll heat the tool, but then they'll actually physically take the tool out of the shrink fit machine and try to turn the tool upside down to try to get the broken tool out. We've even seen some people try to um, shove a rod or, or some kind of stick in the back of the holder to try to push a cutting tool out. Quite honestly, it's not the best possible way to remove a tool. So what Heimer came up with was the shrink out device, and that's what I want to demonstrate to you now. The shrink out device is a special chuck support with a series of rods. Okay, so you choose the correct rod. And what we're going to do is we're going to suspend the tool holder on top of that rod and then heat up the holder and the holder will fall and push the cutting tool up, the broken cutting tool up, and then we'll be able to grab it with the pliers. So first I'll remove this chuck support. And you can see again how the rod goes in from the back of this chuck support and sticks out. And then you basically tighten the rod in there by tightening this screw. So I'll support my holder. So basically, the rod is sitting on the bottom of the broken cutting tool. So now all I have to do is heat up that holder and it will push the cutting tool out. So now I have plenty of time to very safely grab the broken tool and remove it. Of course, put our cooling body down over it. And in about 30 or 40 seconds, I'll be ready now to put a good cutting tool back into this holder. So this is the Heimer shrink-out device.